All right, thanks, Erica. And right now, breaking news in Hayward. Another fire has broken out right next to where a fire broke out last night. A family had to toss their three-year-old out of a second-story window to escape the flames. Crown Force Mike Pelton is live on the scene. And Mike, is it true that you're the one who called 911 in this case? Yeah, a couple of us had to call 911 just about 15 minutes ago. Daria, you could see some of that orange glow there from a building beyond the apartment building that caught fire last night. Unclear if those two fires are related, but the fire crews just showed up on scene in the past 10 or 15 minutes. They are working to knock down that fire that appears to be coming from either a garage or a shed. Now, that first fire that sparked last night around 11 o'clock was in this apartment building up there on the second floor. You can see construction crews working there now. A three-year-old child was tossed out a window, thankfully, a neighbor was below to catch the child, but the, the apartment, however, is a total loss. Now, here's a look inside as fire officials say the blaze likely started in the kitchen and that five people were inside when the fire broke out. Now, fire officials say someone threw a three year old child out the window to a neighbor below. Amazingly, that child is not injured this morning, but was taken to the hospital as a precaution. Now, three adults apparently unable to get out the door jumped from a second story. That's about a 25 foot drop. A downstairs neighbor tells me several Several of them sustained serious injuries, but he ran outside and gave them his jacket to help stay warm until emergency crews arrived. Been a good individual because I'm a Vietnam vet. So I'm just a soldier trying to help everybody in this game. But, you know, hey, life is what it is, and, you know, I'm just happy nobody was killed. Yeah. You know, I can replace whatever, you know, these little furnitures or whatever, as long as nobody didn't die. Now, the cause of this fire remains under investigation. The fire that just sparked, however, well, that one's under investigation, too. As you can see, some of those orange flames are starting to dissipate there about 100 feet beyond that, or that beyond this apartment building. Daria fire crews are here on the scene, and, of course, we'll work to get more information throughout the morning. And wait Daria. a minute, Mike. So you were already there doing the story about the first fire. Had the firefighters, was there nobody left investigating that you actually had to call crews back? Yeah, there was nobody here outside of those construction crews you see up there on the second story. And all of a sudden, about half an hour ago, we started smelling a lot of smoke, didn't know where it was coming from. And then flames started bursting out of that building uh, behind the apartment complex. That's when I went ahead and called 911. But uh, certainly don't know uh, exactly what that building is or the extent of what's going on back there. But you can see flames still coming from that building this morning. Wow. All right. Thanks a lot, Mike. Mark?